Howdy folks, Doc here with Last Best Tool, and I was in town again and I thought I'd swing by Lowe's and Home Depot just out of curiosity to see where we are in this saga, and I was kind of surprised at a couple of things. Um, first of all, uh, over at Home Depot, um, I was wondering if they had any, you know, any more of their Klein stuff on sale. None of it was on sale, not a drop. Um, and they had some new Klein stuff, stuff I hadn't seen before, and they were advertising it kind of in those, those big box fulls out in the middle of aisles. Um, and it was stuff, the way it was packaged, uh, it was all made in China. Um, one of them was like a, a level, torpedo type level, and um, a utility knife, heavily branded with Klein name and Klein, Klein orange on sale. I think it was like 24 bucks or something like that. Uh, but it's brand new stuff. Um, and I started wondering, you know, maybe they aren't really getting rid of Klein. Maybe they're moving to like a second tier, kind of the way you saw some Snap-on stuff show up at Costco um, or even some hardware stores. And usually it was, it was all Chinese stuff and it, was, it was, wasn't their core stuff. Uh, like with Klein, you know, utility knives, they make a handful of different ones. But this was the standard uh, with the replaceable blade that everybody, everyone makes. You can get them really cheap. Um, and the level was nowhere near the quality and features of the traditional um, Klein torpedo levels. It looked more like something, like an inexpensive Stanley or, you know, cheapest craftsman or something like that. But heavily branded Klein, and there it was. So they weren't hiding from Klein at all. Um, I went over to Lowe's, and I actually picked up a stripper. They did have some uh, ideal still on sale. Um, nothing amazing left. A lot of the a lot of the stuff's gone. But I got this. It was about eight bucks, um, and it is USA made, as you can see from the flag there um, and the branding out here, made in USA. Um, this stripper, one of the reasons I was after it, the small. This is going in a vehicle kit, and it is, um, you know, a decent, solid little stripper. I like the handles, nice big handles. It was about 22 bucks, I think. In fact, it looks like there's a dual handle, if you look close there. Um, but I was also looking around at some of the other stuff, and I noticed these two pliers. Um, this one had shown up in a video before. This was the uh, ideal plier, uh, and then um, somebody had made a comment that they found the exact same ones um, in their lows. This one's made in the USA. It's branded USA. It's got the flag and everything. This one's made in China. It is exactly the same number. It's 35038, if you look at that. So those numbers are identical, yet they are made in different places. And so uh, they're branded differently. It isn't just the plastic here because um, the other one was also in plastic and USA made. Um, and then if you look at the the pivots you can see identical except this one says HH at the bottom and this one says USA. Everything's identical here except the made in. I mean it's it looks a little different but if you look at all the words um, it, you know even the the skews are identical. So as you can see right here I don't know that to me is a little odd um, that they would do that. I don't know if those will stay there. It took me an hour to get them to balance before but anyway, I found that interesting. So uh, I think it's ideal playing both sides. And Klein, you know, maybe Home Depot's playing both sides. They want Klein. Maybe, and to me, that's a little dangerous for Lowe's because uh, they're muddying the water. Um, and they could have Klein versus Klein sales, um, which, you know, a lot of things at Lowe's and Home Depot, they compete and it might be, you know, I, I worry now a little bit about both Klein and Lowe's because because maybe um, maybe Home Depot is going to sell Klein, the reduced price stuff, basically get people hooked on inexpensive Klein, you know, and maybe then sell them other, you know, Milwaukee, Ryobi, whatever else. Uh, but Lowe's then is going to have the expensive Klein, which is really particular to those with either the, the need for the better tools or... Um, you know, if they're going to buy something, they go ahead, like me, buying a DIY set, getting a better quality one. But, you know, the effort that they're putting in to the Klein sales at Lowe's, uh, I think now is a little threatened. That's just my take on it. But it might be that there's more to this. But when I saw new Klein stuff at Home Depot, well, they, just the other day, you know, when I was there, I was able to pick up stuff for a song. I don't know. And then... 
the whole muddy water between USA and and uh, made overseas or made in China tools by um, USA companies. I don't know. Anyway, better go see what the dogs are up to. And with that, Doc out.